zero trust has become a buzzword for these past couple of years but it is still a very very important concept if you know how to apply it in the cloud you your focus is not that much on firewalls and the perimeter but it becomes the identity basically the services which are running everything needs an identity to run in the cloud be it your user be it your api key be it your serverless container and on and on that's why it is critical to understand these you know how roles permissions permission boundaries they operate in the cloud you need to understand how to architect identity systems and privilege access model across containers across serverless models across apis and you have to understand how the different identity models works within the cloud be it aws azure google cloud iam is i think the most critical area within the cloud and the area which most people ignore they do not deep dive into iam and they don't understand that iam is they basically dictates the blast radius of any attack how big an attack will be that is directly proportional to how much you have worked within your iam because that that will restrict an attacker for moving forward and this is where zero trust also comes in the zero trust principles practically applying it using the cloud services you know how do you enforce zero trust principles of not trusting any fund where everything is verified by default everything is trusted to like assume to be untrusted so these are the areas you should be focusing on also